Meet the GBU 53B Stormbreaker, America's $200,000 precision strike weapon. The GBU 53B Stormbreaker, previously known as the Small Diameter Bomb Increment 2, is an air launched precision strike weapon designed to provide warfighters with the capability to engage moving and stationary targets. The Air Force awarded Raytheon a contract in 2010 to develop a successor to the Boeing produced GBU 39 small diameter bomb. While both the Boeing SDB and Raytheon SDB 2 share the same name, referring to small diameter bomb, their difference lies in how they identify the target's location. The SDB-1 relies solely on GPS coordinates for navigation, whereas the SDB-2 Stormbreaker features a multi-mode seeker, including millimeter wave, imaging infrared, and semi-active laser guidance, in addition to or with GPS and inertial navigation system guidance. The Stormbreaker measures 69 inches long, 6 to 7 inches in diameter, weighs 204 pounds, and carries a 105-pound warhead. This weapon will give our warfighters a much-needed capability and provide the basis for future network-enabled weapons, says Tyler Alt, SDB-2 Program Manager for the Navy. Built with growth in mind, the GBU-53B's electronics feature powerful signal processing capabilities capable of handling a wide variety of engagement scenarios and countermeasures. The weapon's unprecedented capabilities provide aviators with the ability to strike targets in difficult and dynamic scenarios says Paul Ferraro, president of Air Power at Raytheon. The Stormbreaker boasts an operational range of up to 69 miles against stationary targets and 46 miles against moving targets, reducing the amount of time a friendly aircraft spends within range of enemy air defenses. The weapon's standoff ability helps ensure the continued relevance of fourth-generation aircraft such as the F-A-18. Fourth-generation fighters such as the F-16 and F-15 lack the stealth technology of the next-generation F-35, making them vulnerable to ground-based air defenses. Stormbreaker is a prime example of how we're using digital technologies to deliver advanced air dominance weapons, ensuring the continued relevance of fourth-generation aircraft. The GBU-53B Stormbreaker has an impressive range and can receive updated target coordinates even after the bomb is released. According to the U.S. Navy, the system can receive mid-flight target coordinates via a two-way data link, enabling airborne or ground controllers to send in flight target updates. Because of the small size of these new munitions, the F-15E Strike Eagle can carry up to 28 GBU-53Bs. The ability to carry more munitions is critical in situations where there exists a high number of ground targets that require a high level of accuracy as offered by the Stormbreaker. The Stormbreaker is already in service with the U.S. Air Force's Boeing F-15E Strike Eagle multi-role fighters, having been approved for use on the twin-engine jet in 2020. It's also being integrated with the Joint Service F-35 with plans for eventual integration with nearly all U.S. fixed-wing strike aircraft and bombers. Raytheon reported that the Stormbreaker completed 28 test drops in 2023 across all user platforms. Despite its advanced features and unparalleled capabilities, the Stormbreaker remains competitively priced at approximately $200,000, making it the top choice for a precision-guided glide bomb in its class. Small Diameter Bomb The GBU-39B Small Diameter Bomb, or SDB, is an extended-range all-weather, day-or-night, 250-pound class guided munition. The weapon system is capable of standoff ranges in excess of 69 miles and relies on GPS for navigation to the target. Most U.S. Air Force aircraft using the BRU-61A rack can carry a pack of four SDBs in place of a single 2,000-pound bomb. The bomb carries approximately 36 pounds of AFX 757 high explosive. It features integrated diamond back type wings, which deploy after release, increasing the glide time and therefore the maximum range. The bomb has a circular error probable precision of 1 meter, which is reduced by updating the differential GPS offsets prior to weapon release. Furthermore, the GBU 39B's exceptional capability to penetrate steel reinforced concrete exceeding 3 feet renders it highly effective against bunkers, fortified structures, and underground facilities. 
It's noteworthy that the unit cost of the bomb is approximately $40,000, reflecting its value and efficiency in military applications. The GBU-39B entered service in 2006 and is currently integrated into various aircraft, including the F-15E Strike Eagle, F-16 Fighting Falcon, F-35 Lightning II, F-22 Raptor, A-10 Thunderbolt II, and AC-130. Additionally, other aircraft, including unmanned combat aerial vehicles, may also undergo the necessary upgrades. Ground Launch Small Diameter Bomb, or GLSDB The GLSDB is a long-range precision-guided weapon system developed jointly by Boeing and the Saab Group. It combines the GBU-39B with the M26 rocket, enabling launches from ground-based missile systems such as the M270 MLRS and the M142 HIMARS. Additionally, it can be fired from its own launch container, facilitating sea-based deployment. With an operational range of 93 miles, this ground-launched SDB can be deployed against enemy targets or troops with remarkable accuracy from a long distance, accurate to within one meter. The weapon offers versatile detonation settings, allowing it to detonate above the ground or with a delay for deep penetration. Moreover, it's resilient to electronic warfare jamming, a tactic extensively used by Russia in eastern Ukraine since March 2014. The GLSDB can engage targets from a 360-degree arc. This means it can maneuver toward the target without the need for a direct ballistic line from the launcher. It does so by unfolding wings at apogee and then gliding towards its programmed target settings, which could even position it to the sides or behind the launcher compared to the firing direction. An integrated high-precision GPS system supported by an inertial navigation system ensures the necessary accuracy. Furthermore, while wind and weather may influence the missile's course, the GPS navigation systems can correct for this, ensuring maximum precision. The ground-launched small-diameter bomb has a higher probability of destroying targets by utilizing the ability to impact the same target with several missiles that engage from different azimuths and angles. Not only are GLSDBs accurate, but they also possess high impact power and can penetrate caves or underground hiding places due to the weapon being equipped with a multi-purpose warhead featuring explosive and fragmentation effects. On February 3, 2023, the United States government announced an aid package for Ukraine as part of assistance during the 2022 Russian invasion of Ukraine. The aid package includes the GLSDB, which can be launched from existing Ukraine-operated HIMARS or MLRS launchers, or from its own launcher, to hit Russian targets that have been moved out of GMLRS range. The ground-launched SDB almost doubles the range that Ukraine could previously target with these launchers, 150 kilometers versus 85 kilometers with GMLRS. According to Reuters, this will put all of Russia's supply lines in the east of Ukraine within reach as well as part of Russian-occupied Crimea. Last year, Boeing announced that the GLSDB would be delivered to Ukraine by winter. Subsequently, Russian media published footage on February 14, 2024, showing what appears to be wreckage from a GLSDB tail reportedly found near Kremina, Luhansk Oblast. <laughs>